Okay, people, this is Robert, and I'm back. I'm going to show you how to use the, e the C Sharp program to send an email to a person in the SQL list. So, here we go. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start the program, and I'll show you how it works. Okay, here's my program, and this is the list of people in the email. So, I'm going to go to the last record. This is my email address except I'm going to use the one for Gmail. I don't send me any emails. Now I'm going to click the send email button and notice that the email address pops up in this other program. So I'm going to fill in all my information it's all going to be me my password is hidden with the asterisks and then in the properties of that text box and this is the subject drop down box specifies the gmail smtp and this is the message Who knows what to say in an email message? <clears throat> okay, now I'm going to click the send email button. And then the message pops up saying it was sent. Now, I'm going to go and open up my Gmail. Of course, it went to my other monitor. And here we go. So now I'm going to go to my Gmail account. There's my email, and looky there, there it is. There's the message. Now I'll scoot this over and I will we'll show you the email. It's the same email that I just sent. And there you go. It's extremely simple. This is a real short program. I created a second program for the email, and I simply called that program. So watch and I'll show you how I did it. <clears throat> Get rid of all these windows now. So you can I'll just show you all the pics people's pictures and stuff like that. Blah blah blah. Okay, start up Visual Studio. This is the entire program for the email program. There's the form. There's the drop down box. Over here in the properties, I'm going to get it all straightened out here. <clears throat> okay, this is the drop down box, I mean the collections, and there's the list of email addresses that you put in there. Okay, back to the program. This is all there is to it. There's nothing complicated whatsoever about this. all there is to it. Not much at all. This right here is the load form. Okay, here's the arguments for the environment variables. That's what you're going to use to pass the uh, to field. <laughs> It's argument one because the argument zero is the program itself. So argument one, <clears throat> just as you have when you use C and main and all that stuff, argument sub one, or in this case ARGS sub one, is the field that will, or the variable that contains the email address that I pass to it from the SQL program.
the C sharp is an awesome program okay now I'll go ahead and open up See, I'm gonna click on the wrong one here <coughs> I'm gonna open up the SQL program here in just a second this one okay that's the SLN file don't want to save this all right now this is the send email button <laughs> this is the text box for the email address as soon as I get this straightened out here okay here's the properties here's the code and that's all there is to this okay so I'm getting the field with the text box and that's what I'm using to send and that's parameter one and that's it there's nothing else you gotta add to the program just that code for the button and that is it You do have the start info arguments and the start info, but that's it. Thanks for watching.